What's up, my grub lovers? Who ready to get their grub on? You know that I am. It's your boy, Mr. Grub, back again with another video for you guys. And today, I am doing uh, Q&A for you guys, okay? I've been getting a lot of questions, especially since, um, you know, I haven't been on for a little while or whatever, so I've been getting some questions, and, um, you know, I want to go ahead and answer them. You know, it doesn't, you know, I, you know, I realize you don't have to be you know, somebody major, uh, you know, to, to get asked certain questions or to answer certain questions. So I want to make sure I'm available to you guys. Uh, you know, I don't hold anything back. So whatever you want to know, you know, feel free to ask. Um, and I want to make sure I get those answers to you guys today. All right. In the meantime, while I do that, I'm definitely going to uh, give me something to eat. You know, I love to do my car mukbang. So we're going to go ahead and do that as well, guys. Uh, it's 95 degrees right now in Florida. I, not even, I ain't gonna say Florida. I don't know, I'm in Port St. Lucie right now, so it's like, yeah, it's like 95 degrees. So, you know, bear with me out here in this heat, man. You know what I'm saying? But I, I love to, to, to sit with you guys and talk with you guys. So, uh, we're gonna definitely do that and eat at the same time. Uh, I'll figure out what I'm gonna eat and then get back with you guys in a bit, man. It's your boy, Mr. Grub. All right, guys. So, I decided to do something quick and fast, and plus, y'all already know how I feel about my hamburger, so I went ahead and went to McDonald's, man, we're gonna make this a nice McDonald's car mukbang, okay, so, I went ahead to McDonald's, as you guys can see, and I got me some uh, burgers today, man, the burgers was on clear, you know, stopped to the store, got me something to drink, man, yeah. I like ginger ale. You know, ginger ale helps you with your stomach a lot. And I know I be having some stomach problems, man. So, don't judge me. It just, you know, I think it's how I eat. You know what I'm saying? Like, I switch off. Sometimes I eat really well. And then other times I don't. It's like my body. My body is trying to adjust. It's trying to fight off, you know, certain things. Probably, you know, all the, the extra fats and all that stuff. It's trying to fight all that stuff off, man. So, you know, I don't blame my body for rejecting things the way it does. You know what I'm saying? I just... I appreciate it letting me know when it's time to, you know, do what I got to do. Anyway, so, while we doing, you know, the car up on, like I said, I do want to let you guys know a few things, go over a few questions that were, that, that were asked to me, because um, I feel like it's, you know, it's important to you guys to ask, take your time out to ask, and it's important for me to answer, you know what I'm saying? That's just the loyalty that I have with, uh, my supporters. You know, I don't like to say fans and all that stuff. I'm supporters because people support you. You know, they may not be so much of a fan of your work, but they still show support in some way or fashion because you're taking your time out to do things. So, shout out to you guys. So, anyway, like I said, there was a few things that uh that were asked, and I'm gonna go over those things. You know, as I eat as well. <laughs> you know, just kind of give y'all a better understanding of what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Um, first question. Give me a second. Let me pull it up. Alright. First question I got. Why did you take so much time away from YouTube? Okay, so first thing is um, I did take time off. At one point, I don't know if some of you guys noticed, I took a little time and then I came back and then I took a little more time and I was like, you know what, I need to really focus. It was it was just me fighting against uh, things that I needed to do, uh, you know, outside of YouTube. And I was trying to balance it. So that's when you see me like leave for a little bit and come back, you know, dealing with a lot of things uh, that were going on in my life personally. Um, but also it was just, you know, it was becoming, it, you know, I think every person and I'm not even going to say YouTuber, but I think every person goes through this, um, they get a moment of disparity where they feel that, uh, things aren't going according to plan. Okay. Let's say that 
and that can be very depressing guys you know what I mean from from any aspect of life you know what I'm saying and I think I was at that point you know what I'm saying where I felt like there were other things that were going well in my life but there was a lot that wasn't and I thought it had a lot to do with me putting so much time you know into YouTube kind of like shutting other things off just to do YouTube you know what I mean and I didn't want it to be that I was getting so accustomed to doing this that I forgot uh, you know the people that were there for me or uh, you know, forgot other obligations that I had you know what I'm saying and I think that had a lot to do with uh, why I took the time out and kind of kind of like did a hard reset uh, just to really look at you know my life in general uh, before I took an approach to, to, to come back So, I think it was easier for me to come back and just say I'm, I'm doing this because I want to there's no pressure or anything and I think it made it easier for me to enjoy it you know what I'm saying and I think I, I lost the fun that fast I lost the fun so that's why I took so much time next question I got How old are you? <laughs> um, I'm 34. And that surprised a lot of people because a lot of people they get caught in between not knowing if I'm older or younger. Um because of how I act and also because of how I look. You know, most of the time with all the hair, sometimes the grades, you know, people all uh, automatically assume I'm older. But at the same time, you know. I try to take care of myself to the point where people can kind of look at me and think, well, man, I'm, I'm just not too sure how old he is. So it's a legitimate question. I'm 34 years old, by the way. Leo, represent. Next question. What do you like to eat the most? Well, I don't know. Like, I, I, there are things that I do prefer to eat all the time. Pizza is one of them. Spaghetti is another. Like, growing up, I had, I, I like spaghetti so much, it had its own day. You know, my parents would tell you, uh, Thursday was spaghetti day for me. And uh, I couldn't wait till Thursday came around, man. It was it was my day, and, and my dad, he, he always made sure that that day never changed. You know what I mean? I mean, even to this day, if I go home, I'm, that's the first thing I'm looking for. You know, hey, is any leftovers? If I come on a Friday, I'm like, any leftovers from, from you know, Thursday? Like, well, you weren't here, so I didn't make it, you know? And even though I can make my own, it hurt my heart, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, we, we learn to cook and do things, you know, following our parents' footsteps in certain aspects and learning how to cook and being around my dad, that was the biggest thing that, that, that drew me to food, you know? Um, him being in culinary arts, uh, being a dietitian, like, you know, it was instilled in, in me and my brother and sister, um, you know, basically the aspects of learning how to eat, um, eat right, watching what you eat, watching calories. But at the same time, it, it, it allowed me to dabble a lot in food. So there was no way I was going to get away from that. Appreciate you, Pop. Spaghetti would probably be my number one. Pizza would be my number two. Next question. How many kids do you have? Two. So I know a lot of times you guys only see uh, my baby boy. That's because he always with me, man. Like, you know, he he he's sewn to my hip. You know what I mean? That's like that's like my twin. You know. Um. So you all you guys always see him or hear him around because he don't let me do nothing by myself. I tell you, I can show you guys pictures of me just using the bathroom. He won't let. He be, he's sitting right there with me. Uh, you know, he's just that attached to me, and, and I'm attached to him as well. And my oldest, uh, you know, he's more of a, at that age where he doesn't have to be attached to you because he has friends. You know what I mean? So, you know, I lucked up in the sense of him getting to the age of, of having friends right when my son, my youngest son, was born because it allowed me to, I really haven't lost that attachment. You know what I mean? 
I, I don't feel neglected and all of that stuff, you know, since my oldest got older, because my youngest still right there with me, so, yeah, I have two, and both boys, you know, uh, I think God understood giving me a girl would probably kill me faster than anything else, so, he saved me, blessed my heart. <laughs> Next question. Have you gotten your first check from YouTube? Um, honestly, I haven't. And it's 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 a catch between that man. With YouTube, you gotta understand the consistency does play a part. The watch time also plays a part. Um, so no, I haven't got to that point where. I have received my first check yet, and and, it, and it's not their fault. It's my fault. You know, I, there, there's a lot of things, especially when I started out. There was a lot of videos I did where I used copyrighted content like music, because I, I didn't know. I didn't know how it went. So when it came down to monetizing my video, by the way, monetizing is when you're basically making money off your videos. I wasn't able to make money off of those videos that had the copyrighted content, which at that time was I guess probably for the first three months was like 90% of my content so I missed out on that and uh, the other thing was um, was watch time you know what I mean I, I was losing a lot with watch time because I make a video it could be 12 minutes you know but the watch time I may get per person viewing could be 30 seconds, two minutes, whatever. So the ratio of watch time, uh, when I do have ads, I'm not getting those clicks or uh, those views that I need, that watch time that I need to produce a certain amount of revenue. Uh, you know, because the, the ads or the people who produce the ads may feel, hey, he's not getting enough traction. So they don't pay me a certain amount per ad. I mean, it's a whole science behind it. It's not really complicated, but it's a whole science behind it. So just say no I haven't gotten it yet but um you know as soon as I do I'm definitely going to post that video for you guys as well alright so that's just like a brief Q&A you know just going over a few things answering a few questions that people have had now, you know like I said I want you guys to be able to feel free to ask whatever you want um you know, I'm all ears, man. You know, if I didn't get to your question this time, don't worry. I'm going to do another Q&A. Um, but I did want to show you guys that I do see your questions. You know, um, so feel free to continue to ask. You know, I'm, I'm definitely going to be more prepared to answer. You did kind of catch me off guard with a few questions. But, um, you know, like I said, it's, it's all real life. You know what I'm saying? So I appreciate you guys as always. I don't know why I like you so much, but I do. So, I already told you, I'm, I'm hot, guys. I'm sorry. I already told you guys how hot it is. So, I'm going to go ahead and try to finish my food. I'll get with you guys next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Like I said, if you have any questions, you can comment below. I'll be ready to answer. Until next time, you guys, it's your boy, Mr. Grub. I'm out.